Hello there! Welcome to another quick play, and it's another Master System game. I hope you're enjoying these Master System quick plays as much as me. I guess you're still here, so you must have some sort of fascination with them. Why is that? Why do we have such a, a morbid fascination with watching games? Classic games. I say morbid because this game, all these games are effectively dead. I mean, the 16-bit variants hold up a bit better, but 8-bit versions were often oh, left on the side and neglected, and the playability doesn't always hold up in today's standards of gameplay. Anyway, this is Road Rash. Uh, let's start the race, and uh, Vet Thrashers run 15 mile races. Our race is only about 5 miles. Oh, it's easy. Oh, it looks a bit like Skate from Road Rash. I suppose just because he's got a cap on backwards. Other than that, it doesn't really look anything like him, does it? So, yeah, Master System version of Road Rash. Another game I haven't played. But as I say, I don't... It doesn't bother me if I've played it or not. I just love looking at these different variations, these conversions of classic games and seeing what the hardware could do. And yeah, watching games, I think it stems back to Games Master, doesn't it? Watching Games Master on Channel 4 on, what was it, was it a Thursday night or something? In your oil rig? It's just, you, just, you, you love watching other people play. It's like a lazy way of playing, isn't it? This is actually quite good. Uh, released in 1991 on the Mega Drive and Master System. Uh, I can punch people. Not as good as Road Rash 2, that is the well known classic that incorporated two player on the Mega Drive. Uh, Road Rash 1 for the Mega Drive did not have two player and neither does the Master System, unsurprisingly, as it hardly ever does when it's converted from the Mega Drive. Incidentally, can you notice a common theme with these quick plays? If you can. Raise your hand, and you can raise your hand by adding a comment below and telling me what that theme is. Because ultimately, these are for a video which I'll be making in a couple of weeks. It makes far more sense for me to use the footage as an extra video rather than just playing quietly by myself and just incorporating the footage. I quite like this, I don't really have to concentrate, I'm just kind of... Oh, pigs. Screw you, pigs. Oh, I'm gonna punch some people. I haven't punched enough people. Good, um... Oh, look at that Roger. He's right behind me. I'm gonna punch a car. Is there, are there any weapons on this version? I'm not sure, I can't remember. I've played Road Rash 2 on the Mega Drive. I presume there's weapons on both. Come on! Oh my... I'm going to get you. Oh, you see, that's the thing. You start lashing out and you lose concentration. Just race. Stop trying to smash people off their bikes. Just concentrate on racing. The scrolling is quite effective on this, isn't it? Frame rate isn't bad. What's this? About 15 frames per second? We'll go for 13. 13 frames per second, this looks like. And... Yeah, we've got uh, undulation, hills, we've got good cornering. This is better than most attempts at making a racing game on an 8-bit system, which... Oh, some games you don't even have to turn the vehicle, do you? Just You just drive along and it turns on the road for you. But this, you have to lean. Oh, it's marvellous. Trees moving towards you, the clouds are moving in the sky. It's like a revelation. This is quite a long course. How... When do I... Oh, okay. The mileometer says 4.3. So, 0.7 miles to go before we reach our destination. And the bike is still looking in good condition. Player A still looks in good condition. That's me. This is like a lovely little cycle through the country. Doesn't even feel like I'm racing. Not bad music from the Master System uh, sound chip there. Not the most irritating. Well, I thought this was only five miles long. I've done five miles. What's going on? Did they forget to program the ending? 
am I just going to go on forever into the distance? Just playing never ending Road Rash game. I could probably play this for a couple of hours just sitting here doing nothing. You know, just I haven't crashed yet, have I? This is marvellous. This is the best I've. Hey, there he is! Yay! Finished! That was almost six miles for Liar. Okay, four minutes thirteen. First, seven hundred and fifty dollars. I've got one thousand seven hundred and fifty dollars to spend. What can I buy? Some whips. Can I buy that? No, I haven't got enough money ever. Oh, so that's mine. Okay, that's mine. I can't afford anything else. Let's have a look at the bikes. This is the, the top end one which is usually pretty hard to control and very rapid. I think one of these is probably the best one. This one I think is the, yeah, I think that's the best one in terms of handling and this is just for advanced pro players. We should have a Harley Davidson on here or something, that would be awesome. Okay, I can't buy anything so let's exit the shop and get back to the road. Pacific Coast, coming at you. Cleopatra, coming at you. Now take it easy and don't let me catch you speeding. <laughs> All right, O'Leary. Oh, he's a, he's a nice cop, isn't he, O'Leary? Well, I'm gonna see if I can actually punch someone in the face today. It's gonna hurt though, isn't it? They've got helmets on. Surely fist versus helmet, helmet wins. Every time. Oh, I got him. Um, no, no, no. I think the problem here is uh, this is not a gaming keyboard and it doesn't let me use more than like three keys at the same time. I'm going to have to change this. I'm going to have to configure a control pad or start using the proper hardware. I have a USB adapter to convert coaxial signals into the computer, so I might just do that. It would be more fun than using the keyboard, especially under these conditions. Oh, a bit of a wet patch down there. Someone has relieved themselves on the road. Come on! No! Oh. No, that's not happening, is it? No. I think what I'll probably do is complete this run. How many miles? Didn't say how many miles it was, did it? Complete this run and then draw this little quick play to a close and then go on. Biff! There's someone called Biff is back to the future! Come on, Biff! Come on, Biff, I'm gonna take you down! Oh, you're gonna die. No, you're not. I you didn't die at all. Uh, yeah, and then Wednesday. Wednesday. Another Master System game on Wednesday. Oh, you lucky devils! You've never had so much Master System in your life, have you? Especially if you're from North America. Probably never seen a Master System, they're so rare. Whereas over in the UK, they were rather popular. I think they outsold the NES. Yes, they outsold the NES in the UK. Uh, I had one. Lots of people I know had one. I had one when the Mega Drive was out, which was unfortunate. Because... Because... Natasha? Come on, Natasha. I'm going to take you down. Come here. Oh, she is down! Oh, yeah! That's what you get for riding on a road with crazy punching people about. Shiver. Take some shiver. There's lots of wet patches on this road. Very, very dangerous. If you've got any suggestions for uh, Master System games, which I haven't played, please drop them in the comments below, because... There's a lot of Master System games which I'm, I wasn't even aware of. I think at some point I upgraded to a Mega Drive and they still produce Master System games because the Master System was still popular. And indeed it remained popular in uh, South America uh, by Tech Toy. Took it over up until the what, noughties, mid noughties I think. They were still pushing out games. Which is nice. It's nice that the Master System had a another existence, another chance at top spot. I think it was a Master System 3. It was branded as, but it was exactly the same as a Master System 2. 
Which do you prefer, by the way? Master System or Master System 2? Hmm, tough one. I think I prefer the first one in terms of functionality because obviously it's got more stuff. But I had the second one when I was younger, and that I have a soft spot for it, even though it looked rather toy like. There's a barn! Hello, there's a barn in the distance! This. I can almost believe I'm playing a Mega Drive with this one. I'm impressed. I am truly impressed by Road Rash on the Master System. Can I afford a bike? No. Okay, thanks for watching this quick play, and I'll see you soon. Bye bye!